explain the benefits and opportunities of BIM, it's very important to have a consistent vocabulary and set of definitions that we can use. A building information model can be defined as a digital representation of the physical and the functional characteristics of a facility. It serves as a shared knowledge resource for information about a facility, forming a reliable basis for decisions during its life cycle from inception onward. So creating a BIM is different from making a drawing in 2D or 3D CAD. Uh, to create a BIM, a uh, modeler uses intelligent objects to build the model. The definition of BIM itself is presented within the U.S. National Building Information Modeling Standards, NBIMS US, which defines BIM as the act of creating an electronic model of a facility for the purpose of visualization, engineering analysis, conflict resolution analysis, code criteria checking, cost engineering, and many other purposes. Building information modeling is the human activity of using BIM software and other related software, hardware, and technologies to create and use in a building information model. 3D BIM is a model that includes three-dimensional shape information and does not include 4D and 5D characteristics. 4D BIM is 3D BIM that has objects and assemblies that have schedule and time constraint data added to them. The information can be contained in the BIM or can be linked uh, or otherwise associated with project design and construction activity scheduling and time sensitivity estimating and analysis systems. 5D BIM is a 4D BIM that has objects and assemblies that have a cost dimension added to them. So the cost information can be contained in the BIM or can be linked or otherwise associated to the building objects. 2D or 3D CAD, two-dimensional or three-dimensional, is uh, equivalent to conventional drafting, only performed on a computer. Unintelligent points, lines, and symbols are used to convey design intent or detail, construction means, and methods. Most often plotted onto paper media and published in that form for drawings and specifications, and then delivered to the owner, contractor, and reviewing authorities and agencies for approval in actual construction. When we refer to a parameter, a parameter is a quantity that is constant under a given set of conditions or a rule set, but may be different under other conditions. For example, a duct penetrates a non-rated steel stud and gypsum board wall, and the annular space of the penetration is sealed only with caulk. If you change the wall to a two-hour rated concrete fire barrier, it's a new parameter, the duct still penetrates the wall, but in a different way with a UL listed fire damper. An intelligent object is the object or set of objects that represent not only the geometry required to represent the component or assembly graphically, visually, but also has the ability to have much more information about that object associated with it or related to other intelligent objects associated with it. Think of the geometric parameters of the object as being only one of many fields in a database that describes the visual features and characteristics of the object. So parametrics are rule-based relationships between intelligent objects that enable related properties to be updated when one property changes. Integrated data processing is that which has been organized and carried out as a whole, so that intermediate outputs may serve as inputs for subsequent processing with no human intervention. The same can be said for any human activity or process uh, like integrated practice. Note that integrated and interoperable are not mutually exclusive, but they can be. So a system or process can be integrated within its own boundaries, yet still not be interoperable with other external systems or processes that could benefit from the use of data or information contained within the first system. Now, integration is human activities and data processing for the incorporation of working practices, methods, processes, and tools that create a culture in which individuals and organizations are able to work together efficiently and effectively. Interoperability is the context of BIM, IBD, Integrated Building Design, and IPD, Integrated Project Delivery, 
defined as the ability to manage and communicate electronic product and project data between collaborating firms and within individual companies' design, procurement, construction, maintenance, and business process systems. Thank you.